so I just did a video about the blower, right? Y'all remember that, the 5 volt blower? So in that video, I made a comment. And that comment was, maybe if I put a stepper PCB to it, I could increase the volts because it's only a 5 volt fan and it blows just enough but I want it to go faster so idea let's cut the end of the USB head off and fixate it to this and see if we can get this bad boy to spin a little faster now I'm gonna do a control test real quick and see how loud it is and then we'll compare it to afterwards and I already know that it's hitting at 5 volts like I've already checked that it's hitting exactly at 5 volts so let's continue alright this is 5 volts right, 12 volts here we go going back now all right so now since you cut the head of it off you'll see that you have two exposed wires inside normally on most USBs you'll have four inside and one of them will be a ground and the other one will be a data line which is usually green but in this case we only have a positive and a negative because it's well a fan and you only need a positive and negative now don't throw this piece away because this is still good all you gotta do is remove that plastic and you can retake these wires and re-solder them back into on the points and use this and then rewrap it and shrink wrap and it would be good as new I mean yes it wouldn't look that clean but it would still be good as new so anyway so now since we got our two exposed wires let's take our exacto knife and let's splice them you want to do this very carefully because you don't want to cut into the wires and you don't want to cut into your hand so it's a very delicate process I would say and you just want to do it very gently like that Now since I only have, there we go, so there we go, perfect. Got my nice little rabbit ears right there, can y'all see that? Rabbit ears. Alright, now since I got my two sides spliced, I'm going to go ahead and pull that white, the, the silicone protector off of them. And I'm going to twist it up this way, and I'm going to twist it up this way. Now what I try to do is I try to cut one side longer and then one side shorter than the other that way I have less of a chance of these two touching okay because when I go to connect them one of one of the knots will be a little higher and then the other knot will be a little lower okay so let's let's do that just let's use our helping hands helping hands alright so this is the circuit board that we're going to use micro USB on one end and then our outlets and then this little right there that little knot is how we control the volts I'm actually going to use a pair of grounded alligator clips to, to do my bidding alright now I need a uh, I need 5 volts or Aha, I need this. Okay, so where's the fan at? Here's the fan. Oh, I need a volt. Wait a minute, I need to check the volts in it. So we got these. So let's, let me put power to it first. Alright, we got power. Alright, so let's turn on 
the volt counter and let's see how many volts we got currently being juiced out right now if I can get a lead on them okay so it's at six volts right now six volts six volts six volts so let's see if it works alright 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 now let's get a little tiny screwdriver I need a Phillips okay so we're gonna take our little screwdriver and I don't remember if it's increase or decrease but if I start turning that screw it should increase the volts it should let's uh... let's see if it does I'm gonna turn this on and we're gonna see if it gets louder or quieter as I turn it oh yeah nine volts right now nine volts okay so let's uh... it's nine volts one amp i need more amps but i don't have another stepper that has more amps so i'm just going to give it two and a half full turns and we're going to see how much juice we can get out of it now because i want to hear a difference all right so that right there is ten this is ten ten volts this is double the power double the volts You know, it feels like it's spinning faster, but doesn't feel like it's putting out as much as air, because I can feel air kind of coming around the whole thing here. I don't know. See, so yeah, that was, what, 10 volts? 10 volts? So, I mean, if I keep going with this, technically I can hit, what? We're at 10 volts. Exactly 10. So I'm going to go another, what, two and a half turns? Yeah? How about three? We'll go three. So I just, wait a minute, no, two. Okay, so I just went two turns, two turns. All right, let's see if it, this is at, so this, wait a minute. Let me see. Where are we at? I just gave it two full turns. We're at 11.3 volts. So let me give it a little bit more because I want to take it to 12. Okay, so now I just increased it even more. So now we're at 12. We're at 11.6 volts. 11.6. So maybe a little bit more. There we go. A little bit more ought to do it. Perfect. 12 volts. Perfect. As y'all can see, I got, wait a minute, where is it at? Right there. Okay, see, I got it right there, so I'm going to touch it, and we're going to see what the rating comes up to. We're going to do it together. Hang on, I can't. I'm trying to put it in the slot. 12 volts. There it was. Y'all saw it. There it is. All right. 12 volts. Here we go. See, we have already doubled, and now we are working our way up to tripling the volts, but yet we're not getting the performance we're looking for. Does anybody know why? Well, for one, we don't have enough amps. We don't have enough muscle traveling down that line. Like, for an instance, you can have 12 skinny people trying to push a car. They can push it, but they ain't going to push it very far. Or you can take 12 big, strong guys and push a car, and they'll be able to push the car further and faster. It's the same with this. 
we're giving it more volts, which would be people. So we're giving it more people, but they're they're weak people. They're not strong people. So if I was to double the amps, or maybe even triple the amps, then we can use the same amount of people, but these people would be stronger and bigger. And that's the reason why this isn't working. So it's because we're giving it more volts, but we're only keeping it at about one amp. If I increase the amps and kept it at 12 volts, so I'd say 12 volts, one amp gives me nothing. If I did 12 volt, two amps, then maybe we would get a little bit more zing out of it. But for right now, we're not getting it. And I'm just, I mean, yeah, I mean, I hear a little bit of a difference coming out of there, but not much. So, I don't know. Maybe I just ruined it. What do you guys think? Anyway, guys, I'm out of here. I'll catch y'all next time. Thank you for watching. And as always, hit the like button. If you're new to the channel, hit subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. And I'll catch you guys next time. Peace. <laughs> I would just like to say that this is not Bud.